later this month for his seventh birthday. Lucky guy. He helped feed more than 100 evacuees, and he hopes to feed even more. He says he has learned to be strong, and if you do something good, it's going to come back to you. Well done, Jermaine. No, that is such a good Love story, because when we that. heard that last week, mm -hmm. I, I, I was just thinking, I had a feeling, you know, we, we, Disney's got to step up here. Yeah. I mean, just, just paying it forward, right? No way Disney didn't hear about that. And mm -hmm. that is some good parenting right there. I Hats love off it. those parents. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Got a good young man there. They do. Well, let me tell you, the weather is not perfect outside today, but there's some blue trying to peek through right now, and the showers are very light and intermittent. I don't see a lot of rain this afternoon. So let's take a look. I want to talk about this. This is not necessarily the best subject, and remember, I am just the messenger, but 6 o'clock, as we head deeper into the fall towards fall and winter our sunsets are going to be happening earlier and earlier so what will the sky look like at six o'clock well today the sun is down at 726 so the sky will be blue just like it is in the afternoon but fast forward one month from now the sun will be down at 638 so six o'clock will look a little bit on the dusky side fast forward to two months sundown at 459 two months from now be start to be dark and then in three months in december 445, it's going to look like the middle of the night. So changes are abound. All right, let's talk about what's happening in Hagerstown. A little bit more on the way of some blue peering through for our friends up in Washington County right now. 73 degrees currently with a calm wind. Our dew points have come up a little bit, so it is a little bit stickier. Some overcast right now showing up at Dulles at 78. Notice that wind direction east northeasterly, which uh, definitely is a factor in us having some extra cloud cover. Now for after school sports, most kiddos should be okay. Mainly cloudy this afternoon. There could be another shower, even an isolated storm, but I think the best chance would be south of 66 down to the south. Nonetheless, we'll keep an eye out for it, but I don't think that most of our area practices will be impacted later in the day. So I think your kids will be able to head to their after school sports. Take a look at the radar and satellite from the last couple of hours. You can see a couple little little batches of light rain that were streaming across the area from west to east. I did notice a few uh, wet spots there on the pavement this morning when I headed out the door. So there have been a few light showers, nothing of big consequence. And as we look across the eastern half of the United States, once we kind of get this energy to pass out of here, we do see some improving conditions as we head through tomorrow and into Wednesday. We'll get back into some more sunshine, but also back into some more heat. Here's our future cast through the afternoon into the evening. Notice a few showers, but there's 81. There's down at 64 down towards Richmond. So it looks like the bulk of the action to the west southwest of us as we head through the latter half of the day and through the overnight. Then tomorrow, some clouds in the morning, some breaks in the sunshine. I still think we'll be in the low, maybe middle 80s, but then the winds will shift as we head through Wednesday and Thursday. And I do think 90s are in store. We've had 53 90 degree days thus far for 2019. And I think we could add in probably 54 and 55 come Wednesday and Thursday as that heat really starts to bubble up. I do want to take a moment to talk a little bit about tropical weather, not talking about Dorian anymore, dissipated. We do have Gabrielle, tropical storm in the middle of the Atlantic, moving out to the north, northeast. And then we have two waves of low pressure. One is near the Caribbean to the east of the Bahamas. Right now, the National Hurricane Center says that only the 20% chance of development over the next five days. So lower chances are a good thing, but there is this little area of disturbed weather north of Puerto Rico they're watching. There's also another little wave here out in the open waters of the Atlantic off the coast of Africa that they're watching about a 30% chance of development over the next two to five days. So we're gonna keep an eye on these uh, systems because we are in the heart of tropical season. Hey, local weather, tropical weather, you can get it all at that Stormwatch 7 app. You can download it for free at the App Store, the Google Play Store. That is the best place one-stop shopping to keep you ahead of the game. All right, so your forecast recap for today, 81 outside today, 68 tonight, 83 tomorrow. We are looking at the clouds to break for some sunshine tomorrow, so tomorrow does look better. 93, though, on Wednesday, maybe 94 on Thursday. Thursday, with enough heat, humidity, our next front comes through a couple of afternoon storms. That means some rain may linger into Friday, but a good 12 degrees cooler for Friday. And if that front stalls, it could mean a shower or two into the weekend. We'll keep a close eye on that Saturday. The plane pull for Special Olympics got at Dulles. I will be out there and hopefully keep that weather looking good for Saturday. We're going to step away for just a moment. More ABC 7 News at noon coming back after this. Express Home Buyers. We buy your house in seven days. As a working mom, I'm thankful my mom is able to help out. So I bought her the Jitterbug Flip from Great Call. It's so easy to use, and with a larger screen and bigger buttons, it's even easier to dial. There's also a five-star button on the keypad. One touch and you'll be immediately connected to a highly trained agent who can confirm your location, assess the situation, and get you the help you need. Now get more minutes with new rate plans and save 25% at Best Buy or Rite Aid. 
Any burger can come with cheese, but how about some melted pimento cheese? The caviar of the South with bacony, crunchy goodness layered on top. The Cheesy Crunch Burger with fries or tots for $7.99 at Ruby Tuesday. You get more for your money at Thompson Creek. You, you get, get more. 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 Buy one window, get one 40% off. It's our September savings event, and you get 40% off, plus zero interest until 2021. Call now. Call 855-57-CREEK. Get new floors during Empire Today's gigantic 75% off sale. That's carpet, laminate, and even hardwood 75% off. Empire makes getting beautiful new floors easy. See samples in your home, get a free estimate, and have your floors professionally installed. Update your floors with Empire and get 75% off carpet, laminate, and hardwood. Schedule now. 800 588